For many couples dreaming of a family, the heartbreak of a failed IVF cycle can feel endless. But sometimes it's not about the embryo or the procedure. It's about the timing. That is a tiny hidden window in the lining of your womb called endometrial receptivity. If that window isn't just right, even the most perfect embryo can't take the hold. So here comes the role of the ERA test, that is the endometrial receptivity array test. In this test, first we prepare the uterus by giving the estrogen tablets and once the uterus lining is ready, then we start the progesterone medicines. We give about 5 days of progesterone medicines for a day 5 embryo and then take a sample from the uterus and send it for ERA testing. The report comes as receptive, pre-receptive or post-receptive. Receptive means that the timing of the embryo transfer was correct and the window of implant implantation was open at that time. Pre-receptive means that the window impl of implantation is not yet open and probably you need some extra hours of progesterone medicine before the embryo transfer. And vice versa for post-receptive, that is post-receptive is when the window of implantation is already closed by the time we are doing for the embryo transfer. So in that case, less number of days of progesterone medicine is required before going for the embryo transfer. So this test helps out to plan your embryo transfer in a personalized manner. So the ERA test is specially recommended for those who have had recurrent implantation failures.